uh, office baby sleeping now, so I'm up here in my really, really, really horribly super messy office, um, printing some Etsy labels, and hopefully I can get all these orders out before she wakes up, because uh, I don't like to bring her in here because it's such a mess. Shockingly enough, a cat woke up my baby up, so I did not get everything finished yet, so I'm going to do the rest of it in the nursery so at least she can see me. You can see this baby is completely safe and unharmed. She just doesn't want to sit. She wants out. She can't come out. She has to stay in there. So I'm going to finish getting this done no matter what. Now that's a satisfying Etsy pile. Not sure how I'm going to fit him in the mailbox though. Sorry mail carrier. My elegant solution to trying to get ready and not leaving her alone because she'll probably cry. But I don't want her to get into the toilet so she gets blocked by the laundry basket. Sorry little one. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Stop that. We're just leaving the grocery store. You can see my pleasant little helper back there. I kid though, she was really good at the grocery store. Um, she always is, I have no complaints. Um, but we are gonna get home, unpack these groceries, eat some lunch, and then take a nap, I hope. Hi, it's like, um, uh, hmm, what time is it? I don't even know. It's maybe close to five o'clock-ish. Um, this baby is awake again, you can see. Um, she had a nap. I roasted some vegetables, got dinner ready because I didn't change my clocks out in the kitchen yet. So it said that it was like 5.30 and I thought that it was 5.30, but it was actually 4.30. So now I'm going to have to reheat dinner when Chris gets home, I guess. Um, cause it's certainly not still going to be warm in an hour. Um, so yeah, I did a dumb, what are you going to do? Um, so I guess we're just going to sit here and watch some YouTube videos and, uh, snack until it's actually time for him to get home and we can have dinner. Good morning. Um, I, well, I guess it's almost noon at this point. Um, didn't record anything earlier because today was Caliel's one year well visit at the doctor and I wanted to give her my full attention because she had to get some shots. Um, we were going to go out to breakfast afterwards. Um, but she fell asleep in the car and I didn't want to wake her up and have her be like super miserable. So we just came home. Um, but of course she woke up and she is not super miserable at all. She's perfectly happy. Um, so we, uh, she had some cinnamon pear oatmeal and now she's helping me with my breakfast because she's a great helper, right? Right. And that's where we are. Um, so far she seems okay, even though she had three shots, but I guess time will tell how that whole thing goes down. Um, keep your fingers crossed for me. <laughs> it's about, yeah, I don't know. There are no working clocks in my house. It's about like three something-ish now, I think. Um, we finished lunch. Kelly and Elle and I have just been kind of chilling and watching YouTube videos. Um, she's doing really well after her shots. She's totally fine. Oh. <laughs> it's supposed to be nap time, but she's fighting me. Um, nap time is by far my least favorite part of the day because it so rarely happens and I'll oftentimes spend like, you know, 45 minutes getting her to go to sleep for a nap the last half an hour and it just doesn't even seem worth it at all because I want to try and get things done. And I can't because she won't stay asleep or go to sleep and it's just like this constant battle of trying to make this baby sleep and stay asleep and also to get things done. I put, yesterday we had rotisserie chicken and roasted vegetables for dinner. Um, I put the, the, the carcass, if you will, in the crock pot with some old vegetable scraps that I had frozen. Um, so I'm making some stock for a meal I have planned next week. And, uh, the rest of the chicken that I tore off of it last night is going to go in tomorrow night's dinner, I think tomorrow. Or maybe what Thursday? I don't remember. I have to check my planner. But um, yeah, so that's that's happening at least. But I'd really like her to go to sleep so that I can get an Amazon box packed up to drop off at UPS tomorrow. But so if I don't get it done now, I'll get it done when Chris gets home and he can 
you know, hang out with her while I try and get it done, but, you know, it's frustrating. So, the baby finally fell asleep. It took me about a half an hour, but she's asleep um, on the floor in the living room with some YouTube playing because she sleeps a lot better when there's noise. So I am up here in the nursery slash packing center and I'm going to be putting some stickers on my Amazon products and hopefully packing up a box to take with me tomorrow. I did not get a box packed up yet, but I did get some inventory, st pa you know, packed together. So hopefully when Chris gets home, after we go vote and after we eat dinner and somehow before the baby goes to bed, maybe I can get this stuff into a box. But I hear her downstairs and I don't think she's going to hold out very much longer with me not being around. So better go sort that out. It's about 11.30 now. We're back from voting. We eat dinner. Baby's in bed. Uh, she's woken up twice, I think. It's either her shots or her teeth hurt her. Um, I'm in here draining my stock. I'll do it more thoroughly tomorrow. I just want to get the crock pot away um, before we go to bed as I watch the very depressing election results while roll in. Um, but here's um, what I got so far. Like I said, I'll strain that tomorrow better. Um, but look how nice and dark and amazing that is. It's gonna be really delicious. Good morning, Priya. Hi. Good morning. Hi, my precious girl. So it's Wednesday and we have a new president coming, I guess. Um, I was up all night because I couldn't sleep because I was fretting about the re election results. Um, and this baby kept waking up too because she's got three teeth coming in. So we're real pleasant this morning. I'm wearing all black because <laughs> I just can't. And, you know, my face is not getting any better than this. No contacts, no mascara. I just, I can't anymore. Um, not today. Uh, I put Kelly L in her cutest pants to try and cheer myself up. He's so cute. He can't get a good angle. Kelly what are you doing? They got little cats on the legs. That's adorable. And I'm going to need every ounce of this gigantic mason jar coffee that I can get to get through this day. But I guess we'll see how things go. Uh, so I kind of um, left work early today. Um, partially it was planned because I wanted to come home and sort out this office situation while Kelly L was still at my sister's house. Um, part of it was just, you know bummed out and I think that cleaning up will make me feel a little better about everything that's going on so I'm going to be trying to at least start cleaning up this horrible horrible office in case we have to switch it to Kelly L's nursery and even if we don't it'd still just be nicer to have a room that she can actually come into rather than being afraid she's gonna eat everything off the floor um so yeah wish me luck Right, I do actually feel a lot better having cleaned this place. I can't believe how nice it looks. <laughs> I actually kind of want to work in here. Um, check it out. I didn't touch his desk because that's not any of my business, but I did clean up his garbage. And I straightened two of the shelves up. I still have a little ways to go, but I think it's pretty good for one day's work. I'm transferring my stick chicken stock to the freezer now after sitting in the fridge. I already skimmed the fat off the top. I forgot to take a video of that, but um, it's pretty cool. It's just like a big solid piece on the top and you just kind of flake it off. Um, but now I'm putting it into 16 ounce portions and freezing them. Uh, this, see how it's like jello? That's how you know it's good. 
in here too of the Ziploc bags. I just put them in there and squeezed all the air out and now I'll freeze them flat. Um, it's a lot like my milk stash. <laughs> Same concept. And that here is the fat actually that I took off the top. Um, I'm saving that in case my sister wants to use it for her outside cats. I know sometimes she likes to add extra fat to their food so that they stay warm in the winter, but I'm not sure if she wants it or not. I'm waiting to hear back from her. Well, y'all took a surprise early nap, so I'm going to try and get started on the Amazon box I'm trying to get out today. Um, I started putting together my Amazon box, but then my dad called and told me that his furniture was on his way and I have to sit here and wait for it to be delivered, so we're just chilling. Um, the guys have brought some of it up so far. Uh, there's a little bit more to go, and then we can go back home and actually get dressed. This one here. Oh, you hear it banging around out there? Oh, goodness. She desperately wants to get in the way of the moving guys. But that's a no. Um, we went out to lunch with Steve to a local place called Chatty Monk's. Um, it's really good, but I am the world's worst vlogger and I forgot to take any video. So I took a picture of the thing that I got, which was basically pulled pork and fries and cheese curds. And I've had it there before and it's amazing every time. Um, Calio was an absolute joy the entire time. That's not sarcasm. She was great. Um, she's like the best baby. We sat and ate lunch for two hours and she just chilled and ate our fries and, you know, played with napkins. I can't praise her enough. Um, and now I am back at home. Uh, I think I got my Amazon stuff into a box that I'm going to need Chris's help to close it because he's stronger than I am and it's really crammed in there. Um, but so when he gets home, hopefully we can sort that out. And I think we're just having a frozen bag meal for dinner tonight, so I don't really have to worry about that. Um, so for now, I'm just going to chill here with the baby and maybe start working on some embroideries or maybe do some sketching because I was enjoying the Inktober thing and I haven't picked up a pencil since then. So we'll see. Uh, I dropped Callie all off um, and drove over here to do some work, but instead I'm just eating delicious pastries for breakfast and then I guess I'll get to work. Uh, working. <laughs> I'm on my way to go pick Callie up now and then we're going to be going to my dad's apartment for late night. There's a lot of air quotes today. Um, which is just when I have dinner once a week with my family. Um, I packed this box. Hopefully you can see it. Um, yeah, so uh, I'm gonna drive now. Uh, I picked up Callie L and we are here at my dad's apartment for dinner. Um, I'm gonna go take a bath while these fine people watch my baby for me. I'm so excited my tea shipment got here today. Um, I got this uh, Mother's Little Helper that has um, peppermint, lemongrass, hibiscus, rose hips, chamomile, valerian root, corn flowers. So I think that's going to be pretty, like, um, you know, refreshing. Um, and then, of course, the tea advent calendar. OMG, it's so cute! I am really, really, really super excited to start this. Um, man, so excited. I'm really tempted to open them up and see what's in there, but I'm not going to. I'll wait and be surprised. 
till December 1st, which is alarmingly not that far away. <laughs> I'm making a cup of the new tea that I got that isn't um, my advent calendar. And like, check out this tea bag. It's super fancy and it smells really good. I'm so excited to try this stuff. Good morning, it's Sunday, the last day of my uh, first full vlogging week. I'm pretty excited. Um, we just had breakfast and I'm sitting here working on some um, embroideries while that guy plays Skyrim and this baby crawls around on the floor. Um, so today's plan is to drop this baby off at my parents house and go to the cheesecake factory but I don't know what time that's happening and if it's actually gonna happen so um that's the the, the plan ish so until then sitting around embroidering maybe some chores so there was a change of plans and our child care fell through um so we're just having a lazy day at home and we got order in food he's fine he's fine cats are getting sprayed in every direction um <laughs> Um, we got this local place called the Liberty Ale House delivered, and I have chicken and waffles with bacon and gravy, and there's a fried egg over here, uh, which I'm going to eat separately because I'm a weirdo. Um, and I've only tasted the potatoes so far, but OMG, are they good. Hi, update. Um, my chicken waffles was, uh, super delicious. Um, it's now, like, 7, 7.30, um, and I'm giving this baby dinner. You can hear her throwing her cup on the ground. Um, I hate giving this baby any meal except breakfast because it's always a battle. But um, yeah, so I think that's probably it. We're just gonna, you know, watch some TV and embroider and then go to bed. So I think this is probably the uh, unofficial end of my first week of week vlogging. Um, I really enjoyed it and I'm hoping to continue doing it. That's right, Kelly Al. Did you enjoy it? That looks like a yes.